brother, come here and pray for that pain. Come here. This one. This pain here. Huh? It's like a stroke. Brother, come here. This pain must leave you. Amen. Because this is like a stroke. Come on. Come on. Come out. It's free. Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ, viewers all over the world. Welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Sunday life service under the leadership of Apostle J.B. and Prophetess T.E. Makananisa. And with me here today is my brother who was located during the service by Prophet Andrew Simon who ministered upon his life. Sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Walter. I'm coming from Park Town. Today during the service, Prophet Andrew Simon located you and ministered upon your life. I'd love that you please tell us what he said to you and that you confirm it as well. So he said to me, my brother, he pointed at me and he said, my brother, you have pain here on your neck. And so I woke up this morning with this pain. It was a bit mild in the morning. But when I left the house, the pain started to be excruciating. It was so much that I could not do anything. So I was driving to pick up another brother that I come with to church. As I picked the brother up, the pain became worse. So I had to stop before the corner, I started driving again. I had to stop again mm. until we got to church. So today, even throughout the service, I was in pain, so much pain that I could not do anything. And now he located me and prayed for me. And I believe God has healed me. Even now I can, you see, I can move my neck now. I could not do this. I could not even look at you like this now, but I believe God has healed me. The plan of, this, of Satan has been destroyed, amen. And how would you encourage somebody who's going through what you went through this morning before you were located? Look for a deliverance church. Everyone needs deliverance. Even me, today I needed deliverance. And we want to thank God that today I am delivered. Even as I'm talking to you, I'm becoming free and free and free. And thank God I'm free. Amen. Jesus. I want to thank God who has healed me. Last week Sunday, I came here to church with a great deal of pain. I could not turn my neck. I don't know what was happening here. So when we were driving, coming to church, I remember uh, I asked the brother was who was sitting next to me, can you please pull the handbrake? I can't drive anymore. Last week, we so we went out of the car and we prayed. And then we went back to the car. We, we started driving. In my heart, I knew that the devil doesn't want me to come to church. So I said, I'm going no matter what. I forced driving until we got to church. So when we got here, the pain became too much. Uh, it would hit me three times in, in, in one space. Yeah. And I could not... I did not know what was happening. But I trusted God that uh, today is my day. So when the prophet came, hey, prophet I was sitting at the last row that side. And then he located me through prophecy. He said, there's a brother sitting there. He has a pain. This pain, it wants to be struck. Come, let me pray for you. So for me to move from that place to come to where he was, it was a mission. But I moved. When I got here, uh, he said, this pain wants to be a stroke, but let me pray for you and God will heal you. And then I remembered Mrs. Simono's words. She said, uh, this is a place of possibilities. And then I said, God, today I will be healed. So as I was lifting my hands, that, the prophet never touches me there where the, where the pain is or was. 
Ah, that day he hit me. Bam, bam, ah, I rolled to the floor. Kawela As I was down there, I was able to turn my neck. Heke liko fasi kahona go jigisha Which was something I could not do throughout the service. So I heard him saying, "You are free." And then I remembered, he said, when, I, when we say you are free, you can now start living your life. So I stood up and I went back to my seat. I was trying to my neck like this. I find I could turn it. So today I want to thank God who has healed me. Amen. Amen.